Hello friends subscribe to our channel GDC and press the bell icon for more updates. Hello friends. In the sequence of name reaction of organic chemistry, today I am going to discuss Swartz reaction. So, Swartz reaction is also called as halide exchange reaction. Halide. reaction when alkyl halide compound alkyl halide react with any transition metal fluoride compound with transition metal fluoride compound it form alkyl fluoride so what is the meaning of this reaction to understand this simply what happened suppose this is our alkyl halide compound when this alkyl halide compound react with any transition metal fluoride compound why the transition metal there is necessary i will give discuss in simply so basic i will take suppose azf silver fluoride either sb2 f2 or we can take hc2 f2 any transition metal transition metal fluoride then what happen there will be alkyl fluoride formation will occurs plus simultaneously the transition halide precipitate will form suppose i am taking the silver fluoride then what happen here azx it form in the form of precipitate why this precipitation occur and why this transition metal is necessary here simply one reaction since fluoride fluoride form a highly stable bond and that highly stable bond is highly explosive so that's why when we take suppose if we take sodium fluoride sodium fluoride then this sodium fluoride bond is very stable and breaking of this sodium fluoride bond and formation with this alkyl compound the chances of explosion is so much high so that's why if we take this any transition metal then what happen the stability of the valency will reduce the chances of explosion explosion so that's why here we basically use transition metal fluoride compound how this happen and one more thing this reaction swartz reaction is an example of substitution nucleophilic bimolecular sn2 reaction what why the sn2 reaction since suppose if we take behind the mechanism of this what happen if we take a mechanism so firstly we will take suppose silver fluoride then this azf will get break down and form az plus and fluorine have the negative charge now this alkyl halide r x <coughs> this alkyl halide 
when when this fluorine compound when this fluorine compound have the higher electronegativity in all the halogen so that's why when this fluorine will attack on this alkyl then this bond this rx bond will be shifted towards will be shifted towards this halide compound now what happened the fluorine will get attached with this alkyl group and what happened your resultant product will form r f and this halide will go with this silver and form silver halide and this silver halide will get precipitated why the precipitation is also necessary because all the transition form the precipitate and since when the precipitate occurs then removal of that precipitate is very much easy so when we go with the lee cyclic reaction then what happen removal of precipitate will increase the rate of reaction so if this precipitate will get removed out removed out then what happen the rate of reaction is very much fast so this is the basic salt reaction now if and this halide may be either chloride bromide and iodide because fluorine will attack here now if you take the example suppose this is your cs3 cs2 means ethyl chloride when this ethyl chloride react with azf then what happen what will form ethyl fluoride then resultant product will be cs3 cs2 and f as well as in the form of precipitate what will we get azcl make sure one more thing when this fluoride attack on this alkyl group so it cannot attack in with the direction of this halide so this fluoride attack with the back side of that halide so that's why the isomerism position will get changed if firstly it was the r form then resultant product will be s form so the isomerism will get changed in the sort selection thank you this is the sort selection